working in your professional career, what can you speak about the importance of being proactive and, and, and taking proactive measures to protect ourselves against some of these spiritual dangers? I think it's the only thing that works. I think if you wait until you're uh, either you've fallen off the path that you want to be on or you've been hacked, you know, in a technology sense, you're no longer defending. You're trying to remediate a problem. It's like treating a cavity instead of flossing your teeth. Right. It's, it's a little more painful and a little more work. But being proactive, a lot of it is, is being self-aware. And, and I think that's where the Holy Ghost can help you change habits or change who you are a little bit, is, is initially if, if you can pray and ask that the Holy Ghost will just make you aware, oh, here's, here's the behavior I'm starting to repeat. I need to pull myself out of that and, and do something different. It's usually the basic things that protect us. If you're a popular site like the church or somebody else, you might have millions, tens of millions hundreds of millions attacks in a single day. And they come from all over the world, from every direction, and they change every day. Mm -hmm. And But some of the biggest risks to, to companies are instructing, teaching employees to not click on a link in an email. That might be your biggest <laughs> weakness. Wow. So you have to do the basics, and then you just have to know that Things are going to get through somehow, but you also have to train yourself to recognize them. So it's the basic primary answers and then being alert.